help you. Now why did you do it? They deserved it! Nice. They play these fucking games with your head! Okay, their favorites are aggravating and degrading! They had me strapped to a fucking cot, laying in my own piss for three weeks! All I did was fucking get them back! The administration can do whatever the fuck they want and get away with it. Under 230 subsection B or whatever the fuck they can put any inmate in for, for 24 hour lockup, solitary, okay? Meals through a slot. Three baths a week. Nothing to do. I can understand putting someone in for a few days to cool off, but anytime I went in, I was there three months. One time. I was in SEG with another inmate for three days to iron out our differences, turn into five weeks, and to work things out. Hell, the screws knew we wouldn't, but they don't fucking care. She's a rat. They like to just, you know, play these fucking games with you anyways. Try to break you down. Didn't get to me, I'm too used to them. But that other girl, she was 18. Strung herself up. I watched as they wheeled her body out of there. I mean, I had fucking hated her guts, but I wish it was me that was dead, not her. Let it do, let it do. There is so much bullshit. You just, you just, you just gotta take it or take it and slash and get it out of your system somehow. Or you take it, you take the risk of someone getting hurt. What's the most boring day of my life? Oh, I don't know how to explain it. He was wearing dockers on his legs, on his head, on his feet. Thanks for not saying anything to Grace. He had a dockers shirt and a dockers phone holster. I'm sorry, honey. Oh, I just can't believe a guy can be that boring. Like, even while he was boring me. I was thinking, maybe, maybe I could be interested in it, like study it. But even that failed. I was being bored by being bored by him. It's unprecedented. I don't think Grace will stay with him, but maybe we can wean her off the bad boys. Since high school, all she's wanted are the bad boys. Even the guy she was engaged to was a bad boy. What, a florist? Yeah. The florist from Japan was a bad boy? He was really rebellious. What? Too much baby's breath, that kind of thing? I'm so tired of being big! I'm tired of not having sex. Do you, do you want to have sex? No. <laughs> I haven't had sex in a month. But you don't want to have it now? No! We had sex last week. You came on my boobs. Right. <laughs> It'll be months before I get my shape back. We don't have to have sex now. Like I was, I was prepared for this. You know, this is one of those dips we go through. There's times when you just don't have sex. Like, I mean, what if I got into a, a horrible boating accident? And I, I was covered in third degree burns all over my body. We, we do it without sex. Bert, I'm pregnant! And you didn't get into a boating accident. And how do you get third degree burns from a boating accident? And we don't even have a boat. <laughs> what are you doing? Remember what you were doing in <laughs> Yeah, follow, follow, about follow. Me growing and wanting to work on my stuff. <laughs> the ellipsis. <laughs> yeah, the ellipsis. It's dumb. It's an awful idea and I'm not going to do it. Because like you said, <laughs> this is life. <laughs> I'm in love with you, Samantha. <laughs> it's the only thing that I really know. <laughs> and I know I'm looking fucked up right now. Any more, any more of my life without you in it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> because I can do this. I know I can. We have to. Okay? Okay. Yeah? yeah. 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 yeah.
friends with the rock stars. You cannot make friends with the rock stars. If you're a rock journalist, a true journalist, first you will never make much money. But you will get free records from the record company. They're going to buy you drinks. You meet lots of girls. They'll try to fly you places for free. Off you drugs. I oh, know. Sounds great. But they're not your friends. These are people who want you to write sanctimonious stories about the genius of rock stars. And they will ruin rock and roll and strangle everything we love about it. They're trying to buy respectability for a form that is gloriously and righteously dumb. Yeah, dumb. And the day it ceases to be dumb is the day it ceases to be real. And you're smart enough to know that, right? And then it'll just become an industry of cool. An industry of, industry of cool. And that's what's happening right now. The war is over. They won. 99% of what happens, to what passes for rock and roll nowadays, silence is much more compelling. You should just turn around and go back and, you know, be a lawyer or something. I can see from that look on your face that you won't. I can give you 35 bucks. Give me a thousand words of Black Sabbath. And Simon? Yeah. And you should build your reputation on being honest and unmerciful. Honest, unmerciful. Yeah. If you get into a jam, call me. I stay up late.